But Dr. Troy Cobb at the VCA Animal Expressway Hospital taught me it is important to look at your critter's teeth. It's Vet Check. The reason we do dental scaling and cleaning, it's not just cosmetic. Uh, your mouth is the gateway to the rest of your body. So everything that's happening in the mouth is hitting the lungs, it's hitting the kidneys, it's hitting the heart, it's hitting the liver. So this is Chris, and Chris is gonna be helping me, and we're gonna do charting and do some scaling and cleaning. Before we started, we placed an IV catheter to provide fluids to support his heart and kidneys. He's also hooked up to pressure monitoring, oxygen monitoring, he's got an EKG going to make sure that we're providing some safe anesthesia. Uh, he's also got a trach tube in here to protect his airway because uh, if we get any saliva or plaque in his lungs it can be a problem. So also provide oxygen and anesthetic gas so we can maintain this safely. Dogs tend to actually have gum disease more than tooth disease. So most of their issues arise from gum disease. Okay. Okay. All right. So what he just told me there is mobility means that there's a little looseness to the teeth. This dog has had a little chronic issue with that. It has not progressed and his teeth have been x-rayed to make sure that the gums are still healthy in the ligament. Go ahead. Number three, mobility one, and probed up one. That's about it. Very good. So again, he's still probing around the tooth, all the way around it, try to see if there's any uh, pockets there that we need to address. If they're greater than three millimeters, then we need to do some treatment. So what we saw there was some bleeding on the gums, was just the uh, indication of some gingivitis, some gum infection that's starting, despite the fact that we get brush his teeth every day. This is an ultrasonic scaler. In humans, it's called a Cavitron. So this ultrasonic scaler is going to reach in, it's going to scrape off the plaque and the tartar, and you just gently comes over across the tooth. It doesn't, we don't stay in one place very long because if you do, you can cause damage. So we just gently scale the tooth. Pepe as a Chihuahua will probably be back here in six to eight months. Dogs as young as six months of age can start to have oral and dental disease. Uh, so there are dogs that between six to eight months of age might need a professional dental scaling. Uh, most families start the professional dental scaling between one to two years of age. And of course, there's there to help guide them in those choices. So when we're done with Pepe, he'll go to recovery. Uh, we'll monitor him in the hospital for several hours, uh, make sure he's had a good recovery. He'll go home this evening. Uh, he'll be allowed to eat this evening, uh, about half his normal volume of food. And then by tomorrow, he should be totally back to normal.